Hey guys, what's up? Today I'm gonna show you how to make that glowing line kind of effect onto your subject. Before we get into the video, I just wanna say that thanks for the, all the support from you guys. So without wasting any more time, let's just jump into it. Hey guys, what's up? We're back in After Effect now. I'm gonna show you how to make that effect onto you. So the first thing you wanna do is draw the scope out your subject. So in my case, it is is and so. I already drew the scope out yet. Then go to effects panel and drag and drop or find edges effect onto here. Drag and drop it onto the clip. Now your object will look like a sketch. Then just hit invert and duplicate it three times by hitting Ctrl D. Then your clip will look a bit distorted. To fix that, we're gonna add a curse on the top of those find edges and then just up this graph a bit so we don't have the big glitchy thing onto here then hit the toggle switches and mode and set the blending mode to screen then you will have a cartoony outline of your subject now add a tint effect onto here drag and drop it onto your clip and set the white map to Whatever color you like, I'm gonna go with this green. Then hit OK. Then just right click your outline there and hit pre-compose. It will open the window like this and just hit OK. Now set the blending mode to linear dodge. By hitting Ctrl D, just duplicate it two times. Then go to uh, effects panel and drag and drop a glow onto your layer. We then just then just play with the values here. I'm gonna go with like 50 onto the radius value. Then hit Ctrl C to copy your glow effect onto your another duplication. Then you will have your outline glowing like this. And then go to the effects panel and drag and drop the direction blur into your both layer, both top layer. And set the direction to 40 and just increase the blur length. I'm going with the blur length to like 200. I don't like how it is glowing so much and uh, we are not getting the sign onto here. Go into my glow settings and I'm gonna set it to 5 because I don't like how it was glowing before. Go to your another clip and just set the direction to like minus 40. Then of the value to like 200. Blood length to like 200. Then you will have your effect almost ready. Then hit paste down to go over 3 frames and just hit Ctrl Shift D to make a cut. Go 3 frames forward again and hit Ctrl D to make a cut. Hit T and set the opacity to like 50. So you will have this flicker kind of effect. So I'll leave this again and go over on the clip and hit T and set it to 50. Once you do that, select all of your clip and hit right clip and just pre-compose it. This is optional but you can add an and set B onto the layer. Then you will have your effect looking like this. And that's it for today's video guys. Hit the like button if you like the video and subscribe for more videos. And make sure to tag me in your edit. So see ya later. Bye.